You're watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. A student named He Ting Kim Hong has attracted the attention and interest of Prime Minister Hun Sen despite just receiving a C grade at this year's high school exam. Speaking at the groundbreaking ceremony for the National Road Number no. 41 on Monday morning in Kong Pise District of Kampong Spu Province, Prime Minister Hun Sen shared that he will support the student in his studies until he receives a doctorate degree. Road high, I like a pong tie. How did he, Thien Kim Hong, become the student candidate that the Prime Minister is most interested in? Well, first of all, he, Thien Kim Hong, is something of a student prodigy. At only 13 years of age, he took the high school exam this year on 5th December. He is one of the children that Prime Minister Hun Sen has been supporting since 2017. The Prime Minister provides Tiang Kim Hong's family with a house to stay in located in Stung Min Che and an annual allowance to help the boy be able to pursue his studies in Phnom Penh. Tiang Kim Hong has a higher intelligence level than other kids his age. He was able to read Khmer, English, and Sanskrit at the age of 2, could do math exercises for 10th and 12th grade students at the age of 7, and could also use Google Maps. At the age of seven, he began sixth grade at Hun Sen Anuat Primary School in Takeo Province. The Prime Minister began supporting the student after meeting and testing his ability three times. In 2017, Tian Kim Hong received a scholarship to study at Belti School's Dung Min Che in Phnom Penh in the eighth grade, where he continued his studies until taking the high school exam in 2022. Prime Minister Hun Sen has admiringly called He Tian Kim Hong a child prodigy. Based on my direct observation until he passed the high school exam at the age of 13 years, 3 months, and 6 days, I can say that Kim Hong is a genius, the Prime Minister wrote in a Facebook post. He further added, There aren't many people like this in the world. Kim Hong has more ability than me in computing and in English. This is a fact that I have to accept. The Prime Minister has confirmed that he will support He Ting Kim Hong throughout his studies and wishes him success in both his academic and personal life. The Prime Minister has said that he wishes to see He Ting Kim Hong become the youngest PhD recipient in the world. During his speech on Monday, 26 December, the Prime Minister stated that this student should be 17 years old when receiving his bachelor's degree and 19 years old when receiving his master's degree. However, in order to be eligible for a doctoral degree, he will need work experience first. Prime Minister Hun Sen has expressed that he values education and will provide scholarships and assistance to students who wish to study hard. As for He Ting Kim Hong, the Prime Minister's help has significantly transformed his life, ensuring that he will have a bright future.